Last week, a Quebec judge called Canada's weed laws ridiculous and obsolete before handing out a $1 fine to a man for possessing 30 cannabis plants. The defendant in the case, 46-year-old Mario LaRouche, was caught with the black market weed after he was refused a medical cannabis prescription by his doctor. LaRouche uses cannabis to treat chronic pain, a result of a car accident. The Crown in his case asked that LaRouche be jailed for 90 days and fined $250. But the judge, Pierre Chevalier, dismissed the request, saying LaRouche is the victim of a system that does not give people access to a natural medicine that goes back centuries. Chevalier added that it's time we look much more leniently at cannabis offenses, claiming that like a large number of Canadians, many attorneys and judges also use the drug. Additionally, Chevalier voiced approval for Prime Minister Justin Trudeau's plan to legalize cannabis, adding that previous governments have been too worried about losing support to change pot laws. Thankfully, Canada's new PM recently ordered his ministers to begin the cannabis legalization process. But with Chevalier's ruling and others like it, it's clear that pot prohibition is already beginning to crumble in Canada.